only way we're gonna hold on to Frisco Fields is if you send some of your boys. Great. You know, it's not an easy thing sending my guys into the line of fire over there. They, uh, well, hell, all of us. Expect you to look out for us when the time comes. Remy Duvall came from one of the most respected and wealthiest families in Louisiana. He invested in everything from oil wells to real estate, and he used his social status to get a radio program. Now, he used his radio show to preach about the collapse of polite society and the superiority of the Southern way of life. His family had been here for a couple of centuries, so his death was a shock. But even more shocking was the revelation that he was associated with the Southern Union, a group of wealthy racists who used their social positions to agitate against blacks. Remy Duval, he was crucified and then burned alive. How do you justify that type of behavior? Remy came from a long line of Southern cocksuckers, was always quick to trot out that war of Northern aggression and the South will rise again bullshit. Here's the thing about Remy. In 1965, he participated in the murder of four civil rights workers, one of whom they decapitated. They never found her head, so fuck him, he got what he deserved. I'm in Frisco Fields and need some new wheels. Just gonna take a squirt, and I'll get her out to you. How you doing? Is that a Hot Wheels just like you ordered? That's a big help.
Sounds like your assessment of Remy Duval was spot on. Listen to this. Look at what he's doing to us. Our neighborhood, our homes. Half of one refused to sit by and watch as some rubber-lipped nigger runs roughshod over everything we hold dear. And what is it you hope to accomplish? I will strangle that motherfucker! That's what I'll accomplish! I apologize. Shouldn't use that kind of language. He is egging you on, Remy. You are much too important to be caught up in all of this. Is the situation unfortunate? Of course it is. But nothing he is doing changes anything. Let Sal's men handle it. Sal's men? Olivia, the people of this neighborhood expect me to protect them, not some greased-up WAP assholes. No, 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 I need to respond to this. I need to send a message to those niggas and the guineas that here in Frisco Fields, we take care of our own. This is a mistake, Remy. You could jeopardize everything we have been working toward. Our very way of life is at stake, and you think I give a goddamn about some casino? Sometimes I think you've forgotten your station in life, Olivia. A minute or so later, Olivia called Sal, told him Remy's Southern Union pals were out looking for you. If you head back up there, I'm sure it won't be long before you run into some of them, get them to tell you which hole Remy's hiding in. Yeah, once I'm done with that prick, Olivia's next. Getting to someone like her ain't gonna be easy. Between Marcano's men and all those rich white assholes she runs around with, they'll spot me coming a mile away. I need you to look at our options. Come up with a plan. Okay. I'm gonna look at our options and come up with a plan. What's wrong with you, man? Personal hygiene is very important. <laughs>
Duval, where is he? <laughs> Go on, man. He's putting together a hunting party with the Union boys. <coughs> For your ass! Up near the old lookout point. Tonight. Guess they'll have to start without you. See how they came waltzing in, dicked out in their fancy white robes. Dixie, boy. Ah! Oof. Run that motherfucker out of here. Get my ass behind oh. something! 
What now, nigga? What now? Have it your way. A horrific scene here in Frisco Fields as one of the city's most prominent citizens, Remy Duval, was savagely murdered. Witnesses report he was bound to a cross and set on fire. Let's see if we can get a statement from the police. Chief Wilson, you care to make a comment? It's those goddamn nickels. Every last one of them needs to be rounded up and shot. That's quite a statement, Chief. You need to wipe the shit out of your eyes, son. Take a look around. There's a goddamn war going on. Thank your pardon. Olivia's at the country club. Get in. I'll run you through the plan. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Marcano's having real estate problems. I still don't understand why Olivia Marcano was involved in any of this. By all accounts, she had two or three times the money that Sal Marcano had. Money didn't mean shit to her. From what I was able to piece together, she hired someone to kill Lucho. Wanted to run things herself. Bottom line, I think she got off on all that mob bullshit. We're fucked, Olivia. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> 